Welcome back everybody. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at Aselmo get removed from a military base. Now this happened quite a while ago, but I've never covered it on the channel. I've never seen it before, so I'm sure many of you haven't seen it as well. Enjoy the video. Hi. How you doing, sir? Good. How's it going? Nothing, just not from around here. Can, is the public allowed or is it just military personnel or how does it work? Uh, beyond this point, uh, it's only military access, but okay. here it's public, yeah. Over here is public? Yeah. Okay, cool. It's public, yeah. Over here is public? Yeah. Okay, cool. Can I have your name? Uh, Simeon Vargas. Thank you so much. I appreciate your service. I appreciate your support, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. Nothing, just taking pictures. Um, so, what? what so no, unfortunately, there's a sign over there. That yes. The driveway point. You can't be taking any photography or pictures. We can't take pictures here. No, sir. Why not? This is a sign that prohibits that, sir. Is that is that like a law or is it a policy? It's a policy for our base, sir. Okay. Um. I'm just, I mean, saying, I'm just saying, you know, I don't know if you missed it or not, but I'm just saying, you know. Um. Yeah, I missed it. I didn't see it, but okay. it kind of concerns me because if it's if this is still public area, okay. it shouldn't be a problem, right? I'm working on a story, that's why I'm just... Okay. I came from far away to <laughs> to video record the publicly accessible, accessible area from the base. I can't hear you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I have no bad intentions or anything. I'm just honest, video recording. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm just recording so all, everybody here is a military personnel. So he's saying he doesn't have any bad intentions. I'm sure that's what he said to his ex-girlfriend just before he committed horrible crimes on her. Uh, some of them are civilian workers. Oh, okay, okay. So how am I able to access the publicly accessible areas in the, within the military base? Within the base? Um, so like I said, it's, it's for military access only. Okay. So civilian employees, DOD employees, etc. Okay, okay. All right, so... Wait, so you say you're not from around here? No, I'm from out of state. I out just state? get, oh, yeah. Where I'm from Florida. Florida? Yeah. Hey, how's it over there? I've never been there myself. Oh, man, it's great. <laughs> yeah. It's great, yeah. yeah. You got to go for vacation, you know, the theme parks and all that stuff. Yeah, oh, wait. You got any recommendations? Sure. Universal Studios, Bush Gardens, um, you know, Disney World. <laughs> Disney World, yeah. Yeah. I'm from the West Coast myself. Oh, yeah? Las Vegas, Nevada, and California. Oh, nice. I've been over there. I went to California, do some videos over there, too. Okay. Very nice. Uh, Los Angeles. I've been dying to go to Las Vegas. Oh, yeah? Yeah, hey, yeah. What do you want to do over there? Hey, you know, everybody wants to go to Vegas. Just, just go gamble. Just, just go. gambling, man? Not really, but I'll, you know, I'll gamble a little bit if I, if, just for the, just for the experience. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, yeah, like, like I said, um, so, like, if I continue filming, would it be a problem from here? Yes, sir. Yes, it would be. Why? Because you're tech, because the sign says you're taking not allowed to be filming or recording here. I understand, but you gotta understand, like, if it policy cannot trump your rights. So here we go with the policy versus law argument, and that is a dumb one. And think about it: why are you recording the military base? That's an un-American thing to do. Are you trying to give intel to the enemy? Like, why are you doing this in the first place? You you stand for the Constitution, correct? Yes. Okay. So we have freedom of the press. I'm working on a story that I like to publish. Um, you know, I, I, I like to pretty much go as, as, as far as I can without entering any restricted area or, or anything like that. Okay. You, you, know, you know what I mean? Yeah. Can you give me uh, one second, sir? Sure, quick? sure, no problem. Go, don't step behind me. No, I won't, I won't. So I try to be as nice as possible to him. These guys um, actually protect our country from any terrorism acts and everything. So I don't want to give him a hard time. I don't want to give this guy a hard time. I just want them to respect our rights and, you know, for him to know that policy is not policy is not law. We are at the main gate of the Andrews joint base air force base in maryland Hello. hey sir hey how's it going hey how are you i'm doing pretty good how about yourself 
doing good. Just taking pictures, working on a story. Okay, so you're actually not allowed to take pictures on the installation. Could you tell me what law is that? We were just informed that we had a gentleman coming around. Oh yes, yeah, so, uh, yeah, yeah. I was, I was, yeah. I was just speaking with the gentleman over here. He's very nice. Uh, yes, I really appreciate your service, by the way. Oh, thank oh yeah, you, thank you. Thank you. Happen to have a have a letter from public affairs? Did I, do I need one? Now this is really interesting. He says, do you have a letter from public affairs? You know, that's what a real journalist would do. They would contact the person in charge and try to get permission to record on the base. But of course he doesn't because he's not a real journalist. He's just an idiot on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. To my knowledge, we need a because this is like, to get permission to take pictures? well, we have freedom of the press, you know? You, you, I'm working on a story. I'm not in a restricted area. That's a restricted area past that gate right there. I'm not, I have no bad intentions, no ill will. I'm just working on a story I'd like to publish on the, on the Andrews base. I'm from Florida. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this gentleman. Yeah, I'm You're, from yeah. yeah, what part? Uh, Tallahassee. Tallahassee, nice. I'm from Orlando. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just working on a story. We, I go around the entire country. I just came from, uh, oh, nice. this, uh, what's it called? The Supreme Court. And, and all the government buildings around here. Just video recording everyone, you know. I have, right. I'm just, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a threat <laughs> or yeah, anything, yeah. you know what I mean? What's the story on? Just curious. First Amendment, freedom of the press. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, ask Samo if you're listening, whatever happened to that story? Because this video is about two years old and you still haven't published a story in question. It's taking you quite a long time. You know, I, I, I usually don't say anything. I stay quiet. I don't... I actually really support what you guys do. So I just wanted to see if you guys respect my right to video record. I know he said there's a sign that says that I can't yeah. film and, and a policy, mm -hmm. but I want you to understand that policy cannot trump your, your constitutionally protected rights. Mm -hmm. We have freedom of the press mm -hmm. and you know, I'm, I'm well within my rights to, yeah. to record. Po policy is not law. So if there's a law that says I can't record the, the base, then, you know, I'd like to, to see it and maybe. That's all right. We're trying to get our, our boss in route, our master sergeant. Thank you. Just to confirm. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm going to check his status and see how far away No problem. Is. No problem. You, take that long. you guys are very nice. Oh, oh yes, absolutely. absolutely. We try to be. You know, thank you. Thank you. We're the face of the, the Air Force, so thank you. we got to uphold a certain standard. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. We're, we're professionals. That's that's how it should be. That's how it should be. Thank you so much. Who'd you call for? Oh, uh, mess sergeant. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, we like to have our mess sergeant come out and confirm. Yeah. Thank, thank you. No problem. So, how long have you been in in the military for? I've been in for a bit over four years now, since September eighth. Oh yeah. So it's been four years and a month now. I bet you like it, huh? That's fantastic. You so love before, it. Oh yeah. Before this, I was stationed in England. Really? Lim Hall, yes, sir. I, if you look it up right now, you can learn about the, the gate right over here at Lim Hall. It was actually there. Oh, really? It was crazy. We heard the gunshots. At first, we thought we were training. We were like, oh, that's just the training building. Yep, yep. But then I, uh, the, our controller came out there like, we got a, we got a gate runner. We got to go. And I'm like, what's going on? Yes, 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 yes. I understand. Well, you guys are police officers too, right? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Cool, cool. So if you ever stop being in the in the military, you're gonna become a, a a regular police officer too, or is that in your plans or not? Every, you know, to each their own. Right. Okay. Some people have other plans. Okay, okay, that's cool. And it is a generally an easier transition okay. uh, for security forces members or anyone who has a uh, military uh, law enforcement background. So. Is this like really big with back in there, or is or is this like a smaller base or what? Um, it's bigger than my last base. Yeah. But I can't really compare it too much. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Yeah, because mine was, it was small, it was tiny. Literally on the, the south side. So these soldiers are being way too kind with Asamo. If they knew the man behind the camera, I'm sure their attitude would change. But unlike us, they don't know who he is. Anyways, the supervisor is about to show up and things are going to change. Sir, can I just keep you from videotaping that over there? Just keep it on me. You know? Why? What's what's the problem? It's just. Oh, we don't know yet. We, yeah, we you know, we don't know yet. If, if everything's okay and everything's well, good to be filmed. Right. Okay. Every every everything is good, but this is this is uh, this is what I'm trying to find out. Right. If remember, I'm being nice enough, yeah. telling you what yeah. I'm doing. Yeah. If 
I could just be like, I don't answer questions. Right. I've seen that. I, yeah. I don't. I don't answer questions. Yeah. That's no, what I appreciate. Yeah. I need. I need your. I need your ID, sir. I, am I being suspected of committing a crime? No. 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 We don't want to. We don't do, want to do anything of, of that sort. We're not going so, to escalate, escalate so anything. So, videotaping. Any. Okay, that is a restricted area, mm -hmm. but eyes can. Uh, you cannot trespass. Trespass what eyes can see. Yeah, so no, you could go on Google Maps and pretty much oh, see, you know. So exactly. It's, it's a very, so this is our mess sergeant. Okay. Sergeant cool. He's a really nice guy. I think cool. He's one of our best I I I, I really hope so. Cool, cool. I never got your name, sir. I'd rather not say. Okay. I'd rather not say. You know. Okay. Just to create a better rapport with you and to yeah, yeah. you into our uh, flight chief. Hi, how's it going? Good. Good for uh, you. Nothing. I'm. I'm actually good. I'm just working on a story, video recording the main entrance of the military base, telling the, the guys over here I have no bad intentions whatsoever. I'm just recording on a story I, uh, I would like to publish. This is a publicly accessible area. Uh, the gentleman over here said that um, there's a policy that says that you can't record. That's correct. But I'd like to inform you guys that. Well, you guys should know already, but. Policy cannot trump cannot trump your rights. I'm engaged in a constitutionally protected activity and a freedom of the press, and I'm not crossing into any restricted areas. Actually, technically, right now you're standing on a federal military installation. The point where you walk through that breezeway right there off the road dictates Andrews Air Force Base. But this is you cannot record on a military installation. Do you guys protect the Constitution? We do. We uphold the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Are you guys uh, publicly funded? Do you guys get paid by the public? Is this still a publicly accessible area? No, this is not. So Asamo's trying to do his usual frauditor script, but it's not going to work here. You're inside the perimeter. You need to leave before you get arrested. Well, I mean, if it was a restricted area, I would have said it at the entrance, right? Well, this is not a restricted area. This is a federal installation. Okay, and... What's the then it you should it should be it should it should be okay it, it should be okay because we have a constant a federally constitutionally protected right to record in a public place. It's already been ruled by the Supreme Court that we're allowed to film you guys. So let me go ahead. I just came. I just came from the from the Supreme. Oh, that's not Here's nice. What's that's not nice. You're that's gonna not walk nice. out. That's not and nice. you're gonna leave base, or I'm gonna put you in handcuffs and detain you, and then I will turn you over to PG County. Because okay. right now, okay. with you recording me okay. and you not doing what I'm gonna, what I'm telling you to do, okay. all right, is a violation of Article 134 of the UCMJ. Okay. I'm opposed. What, to what crime would you be arresting me for if I if if I was loitering? But I'm 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 you actually are on a federal military installation. But loitering is uh, standing somewhere without a purpose. I am an, uh, I'm actually working on a story. I pay taxes from my videos. You know, I'm. This is my job. I'm working on a story about this. I have no ill will. So what is your story? First Amendment. I just explained to the gentleman over here everything that I'm doing. I'm working on a story I'd like to publish. I'm not trying to cross into any restricted areas or anything. I have no ill will. I just wanted to stay here for like, you know, 10 minutes or so and, and I was going to be on my way. But, you know, it's, I think it's a little so bit rude. Regardless if you say you have no ill will or not, we have no way to dictate that you have ill will or not by recording. Well, game. that's that's the beauty of our country. You know, we're free. <laughs> we're free to, to do whatever we want as long as we, we we're not a threat. I'm not being disorderly. I'm not saying I'm actually being nice enough to explain to you guys what I'm doing. You know, I was, was still I still have my First Amendment right. Correct. We're still in America. I know this is a this is a federal a sensitive area. You know, I, I, I understand that. But I mean, you're here to protect me. Right. So he knows it's a sensitive area that it needs to be protected. But yet here he is trying to record it. I'm here to protect America. Well, I'm part. I'm part of America. That is correct. You're not wrong. So, so are you still giving me? Are you giving me a lawful demand that I'm I have? Giving you a lawful order that you need to exit the installation. Do you have military affiliation? I don't. Okay. So you okay. do not have an ID access card to be able to come on this installation. I I don't. Okay. So that means you need to vacate okay. the military installation of your own recognizance, or we will vacate you off the installation through PG County. No problem. Can I have your name and batch number, please? My name is Tech Sergeant Houston, and I don't have a badge number. Okay, and your name again? I'm sorry? Senior Ringanieres. And your name? Senior Maboro. And your name? Staff Sergeant Pachowski. Okay, and your name, sir? Senior Redford. 
All right. And your name, sir? You already got my name, sir. All right, then. No problem. And just like that, the video cuts off. It's safe to assume that he did a massive walk of shame. Totally embarrassing moment. Obviously, he has no clue what he was doing back then. And he still has no clue what he's doing right now. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel. And I'll see you guys on the next video. By the way, if you haven't already, please take a look at my other channel, Josh Prime, where I cover a bunch of hilarious random situations. The link will be in the description. I live here!